we are on break officially. It was a very long day. Very long day. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me about it. Uh, as you notice, we are not in the, the, the studio. Studio. So to speak. We are out in Manhattan because today is a very important day. Today is a very important day. Today, eight years ago, was the day that I got our bear, Dexter Dog. Um, and as most of you know, unfortunately we lost Dexter a few months ago. And my big idea was to commemorate, to remember him for the rest of my life by getting a tattoo. I have never gotten a tattoo in my life. I could never think of something that I want that I'm willing to keep with me forever. But I figured if there's going to be something to get, it should be Dexter. So we are heading, and you can't see, but over there that says tattoo. And that is the Red Rocket Tattoo Parlor in Manhattan. We are on 36th and 6th Avenue. So I think I'm doing this. Well, we're going to show them a design. I have no idea what we're getting ourselves into. We're going to show them a design, see what we can do. Hopefully I can get it today. That is the plan to get it today. But let's see. Let's let's go inside and, and see what they have to say. Okay. Meaning one, a meaningful one or two. Yeah. And then sometimes you just start thinking. Yeah, then it's just all <laughs> just going to go downhill or uphill, depending oh, on how you look at it. Oh, it's only it's uphill, uphill, I think. It's going uphill. <laughs> So this is what it's going to look like once it's said and done. This is my temporary tattoo. And I'll tell you right now, this ain't hurt at all. But that's just the beginning. Let's, let's see how it goes. So is it just keeping my hand relaxed? Yeah, totally chill, relaxed as possible the whole time. I'm super excited for you. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. All right, here we go. It, 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 it. Thing. Holy crap, that thing. Wow. We got nothing done so far. <laughs> oh, yeah, we got to fill in the whole damn thing. Yeah. Ah. You you're the one who wanted a full black silhouette, babe. Oh, hey, I mean, I guess realistically, if you wanted to, you could stop it just the outline. Yeah, I'm not doing that. All right, that's not the line. What do you think so far? <laughs> How you feeling? Wow, this is like it's going to go through pretty quickly. How long was that like this normally take? Wow. How you feeling? Um, it's starting to get numb, but I'm sure that's going to change in a moment. Okay. But it stings. It's just... Yeah, it stings. Okay. Maybe isn't always the case, but... <laughs> this, I think, I think I'm okay. Just make sure it's all nice and solid in there. Yeah, yeah. And then I'll let you go check it out. What do you think? I love it. I, I'm still shocked that it 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 happened. But it's real. It's real. Yeah, I really could not be happier. I think it looks great. I was I was originally thinking a little higher up, but I think this is the perfect placement for it. It looks really good. Wow. All right, go get wrapped up. All right. A couple hours later, guys, we got home, hung out, ate some dinner. Um, Eric had to leave the tattoo covered up for at least three hours, so we decided to take a little bit of a well, break. Well, the instruction said two, he said three, yeah. it's now four. Three at least, hours. it was at least, I went a little over, which yeah. is, I don't think, a bad thing. Um, so do you want to share with everyone what it looks like? It's swollen. It is still swollen. It's going to look way better tomorrow, there I think, is. when the swelling goes down a little bit. It looks really good, though, Ben. I'm I'm super happy. It's a Dexter Bear. It is a Dexter Bear. So, I, you can tell. I don't know if you can tell. It but, definitely looks ooh. swollen. It's very puffy. It doesn't feel like it doesn't hurt, 
but it is it is just it's swollen. It's so we're puffed. gonna we're gonna make sure that we take attention and do all the aftercare that we're supposed to do because that's really important. So what you can't see is I like that when I put my arm down on the table, it looks His like his feet are touching the table. <laughs> oh, that's really cute. It looks like he's walking on the table. Aww. Yeah. Your bear's always with me. Yeah, my puppet up's always with me. Um, yeah, it, you know today was today was. It was an interesting day. Um, you know, we had a, a, a holiday party yesterday and, and someone at work asked like what we were doing during the break. And I told them that, you know, today, Friday, I would be going out to get a tattoo of Dexter. And you know, I, I told the story of why, once again, eight years ago was the day I got him, and something that I always said was Dex and Dad always and forever. And it was it was it was tough to tell the story. Yeah. Yeah, it was, you know, just trying to get it out, like I kept having to have another drink of my beverage to kind of get my story out. But I I feel really good. I, I think it looks really good. Um it's still puffy. You're, you're happy with it. I am really happy with it. I'm really happy with it. I, I love the way it looks. I could not be happier to have my Dexter with me for the rest of my life. And it just looks good. It, it fits me, I think. So, right? You. Like... Yeah, it suits you. It suits me. I, I really think it suits me. Um, I'm so really happy. I just, I, I had a couple things I wanted to say. Okay. And one of them was that it, the other day on the video, I was kind of negative about Eric's tattoo. And I think, I, I wasn't trying to be negative. I was just trying to voice my concerns and I did not do a very good job of it. Um, and no one commented, no one said anything, but Eric and I talked about it afterwards. And I just wanted to say that like, it wasn't that I was negative about the ta tattoo. I just wanted to make sure that we had really thought through what it was going to look like and how mm. it was going to appear on his arm. Cause I wanted to make sure that it was perfect because I know how much Eric cares about Dexter. And I, I didn't want it to be something that he looked back on and he was like, well, that was like a regret of some variety of like, I wanted to do this, but it didn't come out right. in the way that I intended it for it. And I right. didn't know how to communicate that in a way that made sense. So this week in all of my free time, <laughs> I worked on creating, I, I merged a couple different images of Dexter together to create the image that we ended up putting on. It was the tail. That it, really... The tail was really the problem. And there was some stuff with his chest and like under his belly. We didn't want it to look too odd. And some of the pictures we had, like his fur was clumping in weird ways. But the point being is that by being able to help work on the image, I got to a point where I was much more comfortable with the concept of this very significant it's not a small tattoo it's a significant tattoo but by the time we walked into the tattoo shop I was like yeah this is awesome like there was not a single doubt in my mind that this was the right decision and obviously it's not on my body so I can't decide that no but, but I get any I hesitations get. <clears throat> I had in previous videos or in like in the weeks leading up to this those had dissipated completely, so I think you did the right thing. Thank you. I get, I get what you're saying. I mean, a tattoo, I mean, you know, for some people, it. maybe if this was my third, fourth, fifth tattoo, it would be whatever. Yeah. But I appreciate you being there and saying, "Are you sure? Like, let's think about this. Let's visually like." I know see it kind it of upset like. you that I wasn't that I wasn't so gung-ho about what you had originally no, anticipated. Right, like, right. what you had originally planned, I was like, I don't know how I feel about this. Right. And I was glad that you were able well, to Well, yeah, no, it. I'm glad you were able to help. So, if you if you were to Google um, other burner silhouettes, they look a little skinnier and slimmer. <laughs> but bear this is- Bear a big puppy bear. This is my pup. I mean, a lot of it He's is a fur. Puppy. A lot of it was fur. He has a lot of poof. A lot of it is fur. Um, but this is him. He looks... That's what he looks like. People would always see him in person and say, Oh my goodness, does he weigh 150... Well, hey, would yeah. I say... Well, 150, 160 pounds. And I'm like, no, he was like 130, 140. You know, that fluctuated. He's poofy. But he looks poofy here because that's who, who he, he was. was. He yeah. was just a poofy, yeah. silly bear that I will love for the rest of my life. 
And now and, he's with you. And now Dex I get to. And dad always in I get to carry him around with me every day. It, it, looking at, once again, other silhouettes, which was helping me get an idea of what I wanted with him, I look at those. And they're not Dexter. They're a Bernie's Mountain Dog. Which is great. Which but is it's great. Not Dexter. But I look at this, and it's Dexter. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. I'm. I'm. I really oh cannot God. be here. Red Rocket, right? Red Rocket. Red Rocket tattoo on thirty six and six. Uh, absolutely fantastic. Um, the artist who did <clears throat> Eric's tattoo is Thomas Lay. L-E-Y-H. You can find him on Instagram uh, if you want to see some of his tattoos. Although he didn't take a picture of this one. It's a pretty simple tattoo. It's a pretty simple tattoo. Um, but yeah, he was absolutely fantastic. Really super nice guy. Very professional. Even though it took 20 minutes. You know, you don't need to work on a tattoo, I feel like, for hours to be professional. But yeah, he, he did a great job. Really, like, really great. My initial thought, once again, was to bring it up higher. And he's like, let's center it. If you want to get something here later on, if you want to get something here later on, it's best to have it there. Yeah, and, very thoughtful about it. You know, when, when I went to, he asked what I did. And I was like, I'm a tech director for a school. And he was like, let's, let's put it here. And I was like, you know what? You're the expert. I get it because if I went somewhere... And I was setting up someone's network infrastructure and they were like, what about this? You would kind of expect them to say, I'm the expert in this. Like, I, I, I hear what you have to say. Of course. I, however. However, this, I've been this doing makes this for X number of years. Right. This I makes what I'm about. a lot of sense. Yeah. And he made tons of sense. He did. And I really. He's really fantastic. So I'm if you're so ever in New York and you need a tattoo. Red Rocket Tattoo. Red Rocket Tattoo. 34th and 6th yes. Avenue. 36th and 6th. 36th and 6th Avenue. Uh, it is the third floor. There are actually signs when you get to the second floor saying one more flight up, but it's worth it. Worth it. It was worth it. Worth it. it. Um, yeah, it's a really nice tattoo. I'm really happy. It, well, it, it, I mean, I like the way it looks now, and supposedly it's, it's going to get better. It's going to get better. Yeah. Um... I'll just say that we'll get to do this again in April when it's my turn to get a tattoo. I mean, who knows? Maybe we'll do it again sooner because maybe I'll get another one soon. Fair enough. Uh, but yes, so I think that's going to be it for the, for the day, guys. Yeah, I have to... So we just everyone knows, I need to put some... Aquaphor. Aquaphor. I, we didn't know what aquaphor Healing was. Healing ointment for sure. dry packed... It's, it's like ointment. You can buy a bottle of it at Dwayne Reed. Sure. So I have to put aquaphor on this overnight when I go to sleep it needs to be covered with that on mm -hmm. um, yeah. and then in the daytime tomorrow morning I, I take the the uh, saran wrap off because I have to put saran wrap on and I think I just cover it with that again yep. and it's exposed during the day it's covered up at night for three nights and after that I just lotion lotion it for two weeks at two least, weeks at least. Two, weeks. two weeks and that's it but we're going to make sure that we take really good care of it because aftercare is the most important part as right. everyone continues to tell us. So we're going to make sure that that happens. Um, that's for you. That's for me. I'm okay. going to go put this on. Just, a, just this one, one just little a, dab. A, a dab. Um, and I think that's going to be like, it. It's like um, the, spring, the salt you. guy, right? Is that what it's like? The salt guy? You just... I don't know what that means. You don't know the meme of the salt guy? The, the... Where I'm, have you... I'm, you're, you're on the internet. I'm you not, don't know... I am not on the internet, guys. I apologize. I'm not on the internet. Um, thank you to everyone who reached out about getting a pin. If you are still a in pin, did I say it right? You, no, you said it wrong. We're not. I thought I was doing so much we're better. We're not sending pens. We're sending pins. Pin. It's better. better. I have to make my mouth look funny in order to say it. My point being. Uh, thank you. If you're still interested, please email us your address if you would like a conditioned nerd pen. Pin. I will be sending them out over our break at some point very soon so that you guys get them. Although, knowing how deliveries work in places and the fact that it's the holiday season, it'll probably be the new year before you guys get them. But they are coming. Yeah. And I would appreciate Best if you do get one. 2018. Right. If you do get one, please tag us on instagram post it and tag it and tag us and we will be your best friends yeah i just i i i i am it's humbling to know that people out there want a pin Love. that has represents us and it's super cool it's really awesome because you guys are awesome you guys are awesome um, um 
really, thank you guys. I really hope you had a great day. Thank you for supporting us and watching us and just being amazing all around. It's been a great year, guys. It has been a great year. Oh my gosh. Um, I can't believe it's the end of the year. That's going to be it. Yep. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we will talk to you next time. Bye, guys. I have a bear on my arm. Yeah, you do.